luxemera.com personalized mosaic artwork of your astrology chart luxemera.com hello fabulous pisces welcome to your monthly horoscope for the month of july 2012 i am your astrologer nadia shaw thank you for being here well, let me just get one thing out of the way first. It's wonderful for you financially. There's, yes, there's some maneuvering, but it works out well. You're also paying attention to your career. You're also looking at matters of home and they're all keeping you busy. And whenever something comes up that feels challenging, you manage to pull out some new talent, some new skills, some new resource that you didn't know was there. And there is financial progress available to you this month. Okay, so let's take that and put it to the side. Because I am your astrologer, I will look at what I think is most important for you in the sky when I do these monthly horoscopes. And for me, when I look at your sky, I look at the fact that Chiron is in your sign for an extended stay and is going to be having conversations with both Venus and Jupiter. This suggests to me that you are going to be encouraged to do some very important work, some work on being deeply honest with yourself, on looking at your past, looking at those very sensitive parts within you that you feel will never heal, those wounds that you've been carrying that you may not necessarily be fully conscious of, those areas are going to get a boost of healing energy. The thing is, though, it might come on and that opportunity to heal is likely to come on through an interaction that seems on the surface to be challenging. And that interaction is most likely with someone from your past, from your childhood, or someone in your family. I would really encourage you to embrace the opportunity to actually seek people out who have been difficult, people that you have said, oh my God, I just don't wanna see that person, I wanna see that person as little as possible. Those are the people that you need to go and find. Because as a result of those interactions, it's not so much about what they do or what they say or what happens. It's about the sense that you make out of it. It's about you coming to an understanding of who you are today is not defined by your hurt and your sadness in the past. Whatever it is buried deep within you, it is going to come forward this month. And I really am so excited for you because it means that you are going to have a chance to not be dictated by conditioning, to not be moved by unconscious forces and want things and not know why you want things, but you're gonna get that clarity you need to make your life one of consciousness, one that you have chosen, and one that is truly your own. Thank you for watching. It'll be a great month. Enjoy.